Well, they thought they got married in 1984, but neither they nor the state where they held the service has any record of it. So Buffalo, Missouri's John and Margaret Davidson decided to get married again. Joe Hickman witnessed the first of its kind ceremony today. Colonial Springs is a healthcare, rehab, and senior living facility run by Citizens Memorial Hospital in Buffalo. Needless to say, we typically are not in the wedding planning business. Well, you're touching feet. <laughs> That's what counts. But they were today, hosting the nuptials for John and Margaret Davidson, who met back in the 1980s over a CB radio when both were truck drivers. They ended up meeting in person at a truck stop where Margaret was quite smitten. And I stopped dead in my tracks. And I said, God, if this one's not had, he's mine. And he's not too bad for a shack up, you know, for 40 years. The two married in April of 1984 in Clay County, Arkansas. I thought we did anyway. Yeah. I thought they held for almost four decades until Margaret came to the rehab center after colon cancer surgery. I'm cancer free now. But as part of her Medicaid paperwork, she needed to show her marriage license. Whoa, shoot. That marriage license has been moved around a dozen times since we got married. We knew we had it. Couldn't find it. And when they asked for the records at county and state governments in Arkansas, they were told... We don't show any indication that you've ever been registered in Arkansas. So here we sit, we got to tie them on again. The nursing facility folks did the planning, complete with a ceremony attended by senior living tenants, along with decorations, cake, and a reception. Everything except... No rice throwing, nothing that could potentially cause a slip or a fall. The newlyweds took some good-natured ribbing during it all. Hey, do you realize you've been living in sin for 40 years? And I said, yeah, that's been a lot of fun. That speaks well for a couple who also spent seven years as co-drivers, 24 hours a day, in the same cab side by side. And even though that first marriage apparently didn't exist on paper... But I'm not giving up those 40 years now, I'm going to tell you. I had to go through them. We're going to keep them. I wouldn't trade him. Well, I don't say that I wouldn't trade her. It just all depends on what they wanted to trade for. Uh-oh, I'm in trouble. Kiss your bride and your best friend. <laughs> <laughs> oh, come on. Reporting for KY3, I'm Joe Hickman.